Picos and Pico Ws make great battery powered devices, but how do we monitor the battery? If we're using something like a LiPo shim to charge the battery, then how do we know when it's on charge? Let me show you how. Hi, I'm John, your concierge to the world of the Raspberry Pi Pico, robotics, IoT, and other fun tech. Remember to subscribe and join the community. This is my three minute summary look at the battery monitoring, primarily for the Pico W. If it's time, why not check out the full video? Monitoring the power source and voltage of the battery is quite easy on a Pico. It's just another ADC source, analog to digital converter, like the onboard temperature sensor. It gets a bit more difficult with the Pico W, as including Wi-Fi has changed some of the design. I've got examples though that show how to do this both with and without Wi-Fi. The Pico has two power sources, VBUS, which is the top right pin, and the same as the USB power, really. Um, this is normally five volts. The second is VSYS. VSYS is normally used for the battery. Both the Pico and Pico W can detect if the power source is VBUS or VSYS. The mechanism for detecting is different though between the two boards. In the Pico example projects and ADC folder, there's a read VSYS example, which provides a library that runs on both boards to detect the power source. Measuring voltage on the battery is done using the internal ADC on the Pico. We just select it to an internal GPIO pad, GPIO pad 30. Again, there are some differences between the Pico and the Pico W, but the excellent functions in the Pico examples repo handle this. I reuse their functions in a simple example to measure the VSYS voltage in a simple example. I send the voltage data to a remote server also using a web service. This then helps me investigate how my LiPo battery will decay while in operation. If you like this video and it helps your learning or projects, why not drop me a cash tip using the super thanks button below the video. Remember, I'm saving these up to get myself to open source in San Francisco next year. And I'd appreciate your help in getting me there and I hope to see you there too. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, then please hit the like button and please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss the next video. Bye bye for now.